Well, the price of gas most likely will be higher when you wake up tomorrow, just in time for the 4th of July weekend. Eric Gonzalez talked with customers about filling up before that gas tax goes up tomorrow. If you have an empty gas tank, today is a good day to fill your car up. Even if you need a little bit of gas, you can still save some bucks. But on average, a full tank of gas today will only save you a little more than a dollar. Gas has been hovering at around $3 a gallon for a while now. Come Wednesday, one thing is certain, the price will be jacked up just a little bit higher in the gem state. The tax rate currently is 25 cents per gallon and it's going up 7 cents to 32 cents per gallon. It's been almost 20 years since the last fuel tax hike in Idaho in April of 1996. Some drivers are hitting the pumps early to avoid the new tax. I showed up here today to get gas at 7 cents cheaper than it will be tomorrow. Stinker stores say some customers may get sticker shock tomorrow and they want their customers to know it's not them raising gas prices. It truly is a tax. It's a direct impact on a replacement cost and uh, not something we're just planning to um, add to the street sign to increase retail pricing. So by filling up today, how much can you save before tomorrow? It, it doesn't matter, I guess, that much. So you still gotta, you still gotta be mobile. So. You know, the, the average tank of gas is about 15 gallons for most cars. So if uh, if we were to apply seven cents to that, that'd be about a dollar five. Not even enough for a gallon of gas. Oh yeah, I could get six gallons today. It was all I could get, so it's not much of a savings. <laughs> The new tax kicks in at midnight tonight. It only applies to motor fuels like diesel and gasoline, but jet fuels and propane were not affected. And you know, the new gas tax isn't the only new law taking effect. Drivers will also see a jump in the vehicle registration fee. It's going up $21.